But guys, welcome back to Griffin's Gaming, guys. Today we're going to go after another Borderlands 3 DLC Pack 6 Director's Cut Trophy. Might be on site, where you need to destroy 50 mysterious Iridium piles. Now, where the Director's Cut is DLC, you will need to have first purchased this before you can go after this particular trophy, either from your respective stores or as part of Season Pass 2. In order to find mysterious Iridium piles, you will need to obtain a mysterious artifact, which can only be obtained as a reward for completing the final mission of Ava's Murder Mystery Podcast. Take care when you've got this mysterious artifact, as like all other artifacts in the game, it can either be dropped, given away or sold. If you do so, this trophy will then potentially become missable, unless you'll be able to buy back the mysterious artifact itself. Now these mysterious Iridium piles are scattered around all of the maps in Borderlands 3 and with the mysterious artifact equipped they can be seen and appear on screen still slightly invisible and have a golden twinkly glow around them. So you will need to walk up and melee them for it to count as being destroyed. In total you need to destroy 50 for the Night Beyond Sight trophy. This thankfully is not that hard as I found the location on the Carnivora map located on Pandora that can quickly and easily be accessed and could be done without having to fight your way through enemies and can have up to three piles to destroy each run. So you want to fast travel to Carnivora and make your way to the giant open area section and then head to the center of the map shown in the footage. In a red chest room with your mysterious artifact equipped, you can find up to three piles to destroy, but due to the randomness involved, sometimes you only get one or two hidden Iridium piles. Once destroyed, you can then save and exit back to the game menu. Once you've gone back to the game menu, simply choose to continue and when loaded back in, you will be back at the open area starting point. So use a nearby catcher ride to then travel back to the red chest room where you can then destroy more hidden Iridium piles. Then it's just a case of simply repeating this and when a total of 50 piles have been destroyed, your trophy will then unlock. So then guys, I'd just like to say thank you very much for watching. If you like what you see, please hit the like button. Let me know down in the comment section how you get to know the Director's Cut DLC for Borderlands 3. Please do subscribe to Griffin's Gaming Guide. After you subscribe, please hit the notification bell so you don't miss out on any of our future Borderlands 3 content. I'll see you on the next one. Take care.